Yo, what's going on guys? DJS here, CollectiveKicks.com. Wanted to bring you guys a deals video from the Nike factory store. It was 20% off the hash wall uh, when I went and I ran into an employee, as I mentioned in one of my other videos. His name was Juan. Shout out to Juan. He uh, was helping me uh, shop around the store and have fun uh, just looking to see what they had uh, in stock. But you could see they had the 28s, they had the 29s, and they had um, the LeBron 11s in a couple different colorways. Um, just some kind of randoms here, some AJ1s. 20% off of, of $80, which is a pretty darn good price. Uh, just some random Jordans off-brand or off-line ones that nobody really cares about, but I thought were pretty cool. These ones look pretty rad um, in particular. And then um, the CP3 uh, 7s, as uh, you can see right here. Another model that just doesn't get any love, unfortunately. Um, Air Jordan Flight Remix. Uh, these ones were $99. Bucks. Or, excuse me, $60 plus the 20% off, I think. Um, on that one, Nike Hyperdunk Lows, and then uh, let's see here. Um, these ones were sixty-five dollars. It's not bad. Plus an uh, additional twenty percent off of that. So it's always fun going when they have that hash wall. Uh, Hyperposite still one hundred and eighty, but uh, I'm curious. Actually, those ones weren't even discounted. Those ones were one hundred and eighty. It's interesting how they choose uh, to dis to like discount some and not discount others. Um, these ones are eighty dollars for the lows. Air Force ones. I apologize for the the fuzzy pictures. They were actually closed uh, when I was taking these uh, these pictures, and and I was just rushing through to try to get everything. Um, some more Air Force ones, and you can see these ones are uh, fifty dollars with twenty percent off. So the box price doesn't necessarily reflect the lowest hash price, as you can see. In this case, it does fifty two, and then twenty percent off. Air Bacon's though, this is the craziest deal probably that they had there. I was tempted to pull the trigger, didn't do it. Fifty dollars plus an additional twenty percent off, so whatever that equals, uh, super cheap. Air Air um, Ups, uh, sixty five with twenty percent off. This is another one that I wanted to get that I didn't, and I apologize for the fuzziness. It says ninety nine dollars. This is a little penny posits on sale for eighty bucks, dude. That is a steal. Those things are so expensive at retail. I don't know why I didn't buy those uh, those ones, but I did not. Fifty dollars. I did buy one though, and I'll show you. I think I have pictures of that one in here so I'll show you when we see it it's interesting that these just say air pippin on them I thought that they were actually called something else um, but uh, but I know they're pippins but I didn't know they were called air pippins I thought there was something else to it since there's a whole bunch of pippin models um, some flight posits exposed as you can see the shocks turbos and 3.2 SLs I remember those from back in the day the just the regular shock turbos the first ones um, Man, they're so fuzzy, dudes. I was so bad at this. Uh, some Janowskis. Those ones are actually pretty rad as well. And just showing you some of the, the walls. They had quite a bit of stock and, and quite a bit of stuff. They had these ones actually at the factory store as well, but this is the kids' uh, version that they had. And they had these uh, premium uh, quick, stri quick strikes. Quick strikes. Um, <laughs> Air Max 1s, as you can see. Um, not, not too bad of materials there. $50 on these, as you can see, plus 20% off of the hash wall. Not a bad price at all for these Jordan ones. Um, and then you can see just an idea of the wall that I kind of pick through as I show you guys some of these things. Uh, Kobe 8 Lifestyle, 44 or $45 with uh, the 20% off. It definitely has an interesting like pony hair uh, to these ones, which I don't think, I don't remember even seeing these ones lo uh, drop, so it's just kind of crazy. These were insanely cheap as well. Hundred and ten dollars plus twenty percent off of the of the hash wall. That's under a hundred dollars for the LeBron twelve South Beach colorway, which was like rumored to be the most hyped up one. And then there was so many produced and everything else. Uh, LeBron leaving, who knows what ended up contributing all to it. I still like the colorway. It's definitely a good price. Uh, some Nike Dunks there, and then these are the ones that I actually picked up. Did a full or will have a full review on if I haven't showed it yet. But the Pythons, which are amazing quality. Uh, for 80 bucks is what I got those for um, on the hash wall. Um, some Quick Strike Air, Air Max 1s again. Nice colorway of those ones. And the Kobe 9 KRM EXTs. Uh, and I apologize, I have two uh, of the same logos but or labels. But check these out. They actually had a, quite a few colorways, or co quite a few models of these um, in uh, a couple different sizes and stuff. Mine in particular, which I was tempting to pull the, the trigger on. I think they were 180 Um after everything's all said and done, which is better than 275, and some women's Air Maxes, and that's pretty much it. Uh, just uh, wanted to show you guys what I saw. If you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. We'll catch you guys for some more uh, random videos like this uh, soon. Peace, guys.